Once upon a time, nestled deep in the heart of the American wilderness, there lived a tribe of Native Americans known as the Crimson Eagle Tribe. They were called so because of their deep connection to the majestic eagles that soared high above their tribal lands. The tribe's chief, a wise and respected man named Chief Red Hawk, possessed a unique gift. He could communicate with these magnificent birds and they, in turn, helped the tribe in ways that no one else could understand. The Crimson Eagle tribe was known far and wide for their peaceful ways, their intricate beadwork, and their ability to forge strong bonds with the animals of the forest. They believed in the harmony of all living things and practiced a deep reverence for nature, but their peaceful existence was about to be tested. One fateful day, as Chief Red Hawk was meditating by the tranquil river that ran through their land, he had a vision. In this vision, he saw a great storm approaching, a storm that would bring with it danger and turmoil to his people. He knew he had to act swiftly to protect his tribe. Chief Red Hawk summoned his most trusted warriors and explained the vision he had received. Together, they decided to embark on a journey to seek the guidance of the ancient spirits of the mountains. These spirits were said to possess the wisdom of ages and could help them decipher the meaning of the vision. Their journey was treacherous, leading them through dense forests, across raging rivers, and up steep mountain paths. Along the way, they encountered wild animals and faced the harsh elements. But their determination and belief in their chief's vision kept them going. After weeks of travel, they finally reached the sacred mountain. There, they performed a ritual to summon the spirits. As the sun dipped below the horizon, the spirits appeared in the form of shimmering lights dancing on the mountain peaks. Chief Red Hawk spoke of his vision and asked for guidance. The spirits, in their ethereal voices, revealed that a rival tribe, the Shadow Wolf tribe, had been influenced by outsiders who sought to exploit the land for its resources. This threat was the approaching storm, and if the Crimson Eagle tribe didn't act swiftly, their peaceful way of life would be in grave danger. Armed with this knowledge, Chief Red Hawk and his warriors returned to their tribe. They immediately began to prepare for the impending conflict. With the help of their eagle allies, they devised a brilliant strategy that would allow them to defend their land without resorting to violence. As the rival tribe approached, the Crimson Eagle tribe released their eagles into the sky, creating a breathtaking display of nature's power. The eagles circled above, their piercing cries echoing through the valley. This display of unity with the natural world was so awe-inspiring that it gave the Shadow Wolf tribe pause. Chief Red Hawk approached the rival tribe's leader and shared the wisdom he had gained from the mountain spirits. He explained the importance of living in harmony with the land rather than exploiting it for short-term gain. The rival tribe, moved by the Crimson Eagle tribe's display of unity and wisdom, decided to turn away from their destructive path. The storm that had threatened to engulf the land passed without causing harm. The Crimson Eagle tribe's way of life was preserved, and the two tribes eventually became allies, learning from each other and thriving in harmony with nature. And so, the legend of the Crimson Eagle tribe lived on, a testament to the power of unity, wisdom, and the profound connection between humans and the natural world. The tribe continued to live peacefully, guided by Chief Red Hawk's vision and the wisdom of the ancient spirits of the mountains.